Seasons change, quality of service doesn't. For 75 years, First Franklin Financial has been serving the financial needs of your friends and neighbors. You can always depend on the caring staff to be there when you need them. Drop by and see your friendly Franklin folks at 1074 North Macon Street or give them a call at 427-4237 or apply online at 1FFC.com. All loans are subject to our liberal credit policy and limitations, if any. First Franklin Financial Corporation, NMLSR number 141654. Georgia Residential Mortgage License number 5656. This is Charles Huffman at Jessup Housing Outlet. If you haven't been to Jessup Housing Outlet lately, you're missing out on a large selection of new and exciting floor plans from the nation's top manufacturers like Clayton, Fleetwood, Scott Built, and Homes of Merit. All of our homes feature modern kitchens and appliances, R60 and higher insulation values, thermopane windows, and energy-efficient heat pumps. We have two locations to serve you, 2452 Savannah Highway in Jessup and Highway 301 South between I-16 and the bypass in Statesboro. Come see Charles they are shared it today. Local news on WIFO. It's time now for a look latest in local news. In the news, the Georgia School Nutrition Program will once again be providing free meals this summer, feeding Georgia's kids, and the program kicks off on June 5th. We'll run Monday through Friday through July 21st. It'll be closed July 3rd through the 5th for the July 4th holiday. Wayne County High School will then continue the program from July 24th through July 28th. Breakfast and lunch will be provided beginning June 5th at the following locations here in Wayne County. And there are many locations in Wayne County. Wayne County High School, Bamboo Street Site, Bayview Apartments, Venice Estates, Boys and Girls Club, Briarwood Estates, Chapman Plantation, Cowboy Road, Deborah Circle, Deerwood Manor, Dogwood Estates, Eternal House of Refuge, Hires Road, James E. Bacon School, Jessup Elementary, Martha Ross Smith Elementary, Morning Glory Church, New Life Ministries, Odom Recreational Center, Pine View Center, Riverside Site, Roger Street, Sandy Oaks, Scriven Community Center, Seminole Woods, Shellcracker Road, St. John's Holiness Church, Sunset Villas, and Tangwood Park Site. Again, those are the locations Monday through Friday, June 5th through July 21st. Once again, this is a federally funded program. If you need more information, call the National Hunger Hotline, 1-866-3-HUNGRY. Again, the program kicks off on June the 5th, and again, it runs through July 21st here in Wayne County. Wayne County getting ready for the catfish tournament set for this weekend, Saturday and Sunday. Bay State, the river is ready, and it's time to fish in the Wayne County Board of Tourism's annual Wayne County Catfish Tournament. It will take place Saturday, 12 noon, continue until Sunday, 2 p.m. This year's event offers anglers the opportunity to win up to $7,500 in payout. Prizes are based on the number of entries into the event. Weigh-in and tournament headquarters once again at J.C. Fairgrounds at J.C. Landing. Those fishing the event can put in anywhere in the Altamar River, but they must be in line at weigh-in at the fairgrounds this Sunday by 2 p.m. Entry fee for the event is $100 per fisherman with a minimum of at least two fishing in a boat. Big Fish Pot entry is $10 per fisherman. Registration can be done online at active.com, or you can drop it off at the Tourism Board's office at the depot. Registration packets are available at most bait and tackle stores at the train depot or at Odom and Scriven City Halls. For more information, call the Tourism Board office at 427-3233 or check out the Tourism Board website at waynetourism.com. Again, they state the fish are on and they're ready for the boats this weekend. Again, June 3rd and 4th, Saturday and Sunday, the annual Wayne County Catfish Tournament here in Wayne County. We'll be back with more news after this word from our sponsor of the commercial messages, so please stay tuned. It's a new and better way to buy. It's live market pricing at Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC on East Cherry Street. We constantly monitor auto websites to offer the most aggressive market prices. The low market price is our live market price. That's why we're the home of the no-hassle deal. Save time, save money, and know for sure that Neesmith's live market prices are the lowest possible price that we can offer. Neesmith Chevrolet. Chevy, find new roads. Stop creditor harassment today. Stop the worry of a pending repossession, garnishment, or foreclosure. Contact the Bankruptcy Group, Attorney R. Flake Cabinets, for an experienced assessment of your financial situation. They have locations in Brunswick, Hazelhurst, and now Jessup. They are a debt relief agency. They help people file for bankruptcy relief. Contact legal assistant Tanya Blanton at 912-375-5620. 375-5620 to set up your free consultation. Let the Bankruptcy Group do the worrying for you now serving Jessup. 
Morton Collision is located at 1320 West Pine Street in Jessup. Morton's offers free estimates, 23-hour towing, and they guarantee their work. Call 427-3769 or after hours, 912-294-6140. The staff at Morton Collision Center works with all insurance companies. So for guaranteed work with a qualified staff, go to Morton Collision at 1320 West Pine Street in Jessup. Morton Collision, quality you can see. Top Notch Lawn Care is here to serve you. Keep your lawn looking great this summer. Let us cut, edge, trim, and maintain your yard. If you're tired of working on that old lawnmower or spending your spare time cutting grass, sit back and relax. Call my daddy, Jerry Scarborough, at 912-271-3368. He's the best. Call me today for a free estimate, 912-271-3368. Altamont Community Theater's production of Beauty is a Beast is going to be performed both tonight and Friday night at the K. Cagle Theater. Showtime each night, 6.30. Seating is the first come, first serve, so they ask that you arrive early. According to our and to the students on hand Wednesday's Pitch and Bomb show to promote the production. And it begins tonight at 6.30. Also a show at 6.30 Friday night at the K. Cagle Theater at the high school. And the Altamont Community Theater's production, Beauty is a Beast, tonight and tomorrow night at the high school auditorium. Wayne County Commissioners meet Monday, June 5th. The agenda is out. Under Citizens Concerns, Mark Watson, Jessup Housing Authority concerning George Initiative for Community Housing. Under Consent Agenda, Mike Roberts considering approved adopting Martin's Landing Road. Under New Business, considering approved Public Defender Agreement Budget for 2018. Considering approved a Library Budget for 2018. Considering approved Agreement with Web Electronics for Recreational Website. Considering approved Intergovernmental Agreement with City on Inert Landfill. Several Board Appointments on the agenda. Items with the Administrator, Items with the Commissioners. Executive session discuss personnel and all that set for Monday, June 5th at the County Commissioner's Meeting Room. Jessup City Commissioner Stanley Todd organizing a neighborhood watch program for District 4. Todd says it's important to learn how neighbors can help protect and make, a, make the neighborhood safer places to live. The meeting is planned for Monday, June 5th at 7 p.m. at the Jessup Police Department. Officer Greg Roche will be the leader and facilitator of the meeting. Commissioner Stanley Todd says this is an important meeting. For those in District 4, and he asked all the residents to please attend. Again, it's set for Monday, June 5th, 7 p.m. at the Jessup Police Department. Jessup Police Chief Glenn Takagi will be retiring in October. City of Jessup still taking applications to fill the position of Police Chief. Salary will be determined based on qualifications. Detailed job description is available on the city's website at jessupgeorgia.gov. Interested applicants should mail their resume to Rose Jackson, City Clerk, Treasurer of the City of Jessup, P.O. Box 427, Jessup, Georgia 31598. They say to shortly describing your vision and goals for the department must be attached. Again, the city adjusts of an equal opportunity employer. Again, taking applications for this position of police chief. We'll be back with some final news notes after this word from our sponsor of the commercial messages. So please stay tuned. It's a new and better way to buy. It's live market pricing at Neesmith Chevrolet Buick GMC on East Cherry Street. We constantly monitor auto websites to offer the most aggressive market prices. The low market price is our live market price. That's why we're the home of the no-hassle deal. Save time, save money, and know for sure that Neesmith's live market prices are the lowest possible price that we can offer. Neesmith Chevrolet. Chevy, find new roads. Advanced Healthcare Center on South First Street in Jessup is your one-stop health shop for most all your health care needs. They offer same-day appointments, and walk-ins are welcome for medical, chiropractic, physical therapy, and massage therapy care for immediate treatment and pain relief for injuries and illnesses of all conditions. Advanced Healthcare specializes in the treatment of spinal and joint pains, headaches, neurological and muscle conditions, and family medical needs. Advanced Healthcare accepts and files most major insurance plans, accepts motor vehicle and workman's comp cases, and they make self-pay plans affordable for everyone so you can get the care you need right away. Call or walk into Advanced Healthcare Center on South First Street in Jessup or visit their website at ahc4health.com to explore the many ways they can quickly serve you. Advanced Healthcare Center, serving the Wayne County area for over 27 years, Feel better today.
Murphy's Builder Supply is where you need to go for all your home improvement projects and hardware needs. They've been serving folks in this area since 1946. Murphy's offers some products and services that you may not know about. They now sell ammunition, both bullets and shells. Murphy's also sells personalized tags for dog collars. They build customized screens for windows and doors. Murphy's can rekey locks, and of course they can make keys. They cut glass for windows, plus Murphy's has monthly door buster specials. Check their Facebook page to see what's on sale. Murphy's Builder Supply, 156 Northeast Broad Street, Jessup. Final notes of news today marks the start of shrimp season in the state of Georgia. Last year, 261 licensed shrimp trawlers and 25 cast net shrimp harvesters brought an estimated $8.3 million worth of shrimp for the state. As the season begins, commercial harvest food shrimp with power-drawn trawls in the state waters allowed from 30 minutes before sunrise to 30 minutes after sunset. Federal waters beyond three miles offshore open for food shrimp harvest 24 hours a day. In shrimp season, they state ends typically late December, mid-January. Finally, in the news, the Wayne County High School Band will have two feature twirlers this year. As the meeting was held Wednesday afternoon, the announcement was made that both Emily Teston and Ellie Tynes will be the two feature twirlers in the high school band this season. Trials were held for feature twirler position, but at the time, no announcement was made. It was stated that no one stood out during the tryouts. There will not be a feature twirler this year, but the last school board meeting of the high school band was on the agenda and voted to be discussed in executive session. WIFO theme reported at the time that the majorette trials was part of the discussion about the ban. Again, a meeting held Wednesday with the band majorettes, and at the meeting, the announcement that both Emily Teston and Ellie Tynson will now be your featured twirlers this year with the high school ban. That's going to do it for latest in local news. Sports comes your way in a few minutes. Bob Morgan saying have a great day. You've been listening to local news on WIFO. Can you find it? Can you find it? It is here! The Georgia Dermatology WIFOFM Big Dog Country Cash! Cash. Cash. One specially marked can.